We're in Downer, Minnesota, and we brought a diverse group of customers in to test and evaluate the performance differences of a Steiger Quad Track versus a Deer RX. So before we began driving each piece of equipment, we evaluated and went through the differences, uh, not specifically pointing out what's good or bad about each of them. So we drove uh, a Case uh, 620 quad track with a 875 ripper and we drove the uh, John Deere four track machine with the same ripper behind it in some CRP ground. Uh, we were asked to take each tractor, um, run it at five miles an hour, six mile an hour, and seven mile an hour. We were asked to compare a visual, the the exterior, the, uh, the maintenance ability, the comfortability, the ride, the traction, the horsepower, slippage, uh, and uh, fuel consumption. Well, right off the bat, I mean, definitely the ride quality of the case was superior. Um, personally, I would have took a wheel tractor over the John Deere tracks. And when we got in the green tractor, it was by far a, a, a wiggly tractor, a, a wiggly ride. The ride in the John Deere was rough. You could feel the cab banging. On the John Deere itself, I felt like more of the components were shaking as I was driving, specifically the hood and the fuel tank. They're always moving and bouncing, and that, that specifically concerned me. The Deere was definitely harder on fuel. All the way through all the mile per hour settings so from five six and seven it was two gallons to four gallons more on each increment all the way up visibility out of the cab of the, the case quad track is i think far superior on the deer i was surprised at how poor the, the visibility was for the, the hitch and to be able to see the hitch is really important and on the case it's very visible hooking up input with a deer would be a much harder uh, process and probably require two people i really miss the hand control in the case where everything's right there. You don't have to move your hand at all. Where the John Deere, you shift here, throttle here, hydraulics here. And then having the two monitors, I am kind of scratched my head a little bit on that. Why can't you just have one? I was very surprised at how difficult it was to open the hood of the John Deere. I'm tall. If somebody was 5'6", weighed 150 pounds, I don't know if that, how they could lift that hood up. The interior and the deer seemed more plasticky and more plasticky on the outside. I really was surprised about how much more maneuverable the red quad track was than the green four track unit. I've thoroughly enjoyed my experience today, but uh, it has made me more confident in our decision to run the Case Quad Track. If I had to choose between the two tractors, it, it, it's not even a comparison. Um, I would choose the red one. Me personally, I would take the Case Tractor. It's like the John Deere is a prototype. It's, it just doesn't seem ready. I was thoroughly amazed at the difference. Uh, and if I hadn't tried it, I would never believe how much of a difference there is. The Case Quad Track is the best choice for uh, safety, for proven design, for maintenance, and for resale overall.